It's not good enough for me since I've been with you. Ooh. It's not gonna work for you. Nobody can equal me. No, no. Hey everyone, I hope you're well. Welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new here, my name is Steffi. I am wearing a top, by the way. I know it looks like I am not, but I am currently in Abu Dhabi. And Sol is here, so you got to say hi now. Hello. Hello. We're on holiday. I'm not actually wearing holiday. any makeup right holiday. now, holiday. guys. Holiday. Holiday. I'm just going to show you this hat. Yeah, I'm going to pretend it's Sina, but I pretended I stole it from her. This is. Do you remember when I told you guys Sina once spent 500 quid or something on a hat? Like, how much did she spend? On this. I'm sorry, but it looks something like something from accessories. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Maison Michel hat or something, and I pretended that I was gonna wear it, and she's never worn it before. And bless her, she was like, "Yeah, okay, wear it." Like she didn't even say anything. It was so <laughs> funny, but I felt so bad for. Her. Anyway, we are in Abu Dhabi. We are going to Dubai now. So this is actually the start of my Dubai vlog. So welcome to Dubai. Um, well, when we get there. But before I get into the vlog and all the fun that we're going to have, we have so much fun stuff planned. I'm going to start off by showing you some of the jewelry I'm going to be wearing on this holiday. This video has kindly been sponsored by Ana Luisa. You guys have seen, I absolutely love their brand. I'm always wearing their jewelry and I just can't get enough of their pieces. I'm especially loving bringing these on holiday because the colour doesn't tarnish. So I can wear them by the pool and not worry about anything. They are very environmentally friendly. They're currently running the biggest sale of the year on their website. I will leave the link down in the description for you guys to shop, but let me show you the pieces that I have chosen. So first up is this beautiful ring. As you can see, it has got little um, diamantes inside it, which I absolutely love. It glistens in the sun and it is gold. I got mine in a size 7, that's another thing that I love about Ana Luisa is that you can pick your own sizes and um, make it unique to you so that if you want it to go on your little finger or on your thumb you can just pick a different size and go from there. Um, I love this one, I just think it's such a classic piece and it really looks just nice on my hand, it looks really elegant. Which is why I chose this next piece, this beautiful ring, it's almost like a double um, ring but it's like got this really cool like arch detailing where you can see both the stones at the same time and the light reflects off it so beautifully and I just thought this goes so well with the first ring and I could wear that on the opposite hand or I could stack it on top and it would just look so nice um, so I absolutely adore this. So I got these beautiful diamante earrings. They're like a triple layer, which I think is so cool for an added chunky effect. And the diamantes match the diamantes in my rings. So I just think that this is such a cute set to have all together. Um, if you pair it all with like even more gold jewelry, they have so much to pick from from their website. If you check it out, then you will love them too. But look at that, so beautiful how beautiful i love it i just think i look very holiday ready and even more with the tan i just think that these um jewelry pieces will bounce so i am obsessed don't forget to check out the pieces that i've just shown you down in the description along with all the other pieces on their website which has a huge 20 percent off sale going on and you guys should defo enjoy that and indulge okay let's continue with the holiday fun so this is currently the view from our hotel room we're staying at the intercontinental we're only staying here for we only stayed here for one night um, we're not staying for any longer because we're going to Dubai and then when we come back to Abu Dhabi We're staying at a different hotel, which you guys will see in the Abu Dhabi vlog um, But I don't actually love this hotel to be honest with you guys like it's cute. It's nice oh. It's just got this old feel like Sol says it reminds me a bit of if any of you guys have watched my Malaysia vlog When we went to Kuala Lumpur, it reminds me a lot of the Shangri-La Kuala Lumpur um, So it's like obviously a really nice the Shangri -La is so much better there. Yeah, the Shangri-La is so much better the room setup reminds Reminds me of that, but um, we're gonna go eat breakfast now, so come down with us. Yeah, do you see what I mean by this hotel? Just gives me like old vibes, I don't know. And also, I'm used to hotel like hallways, especially like in UAE in Dubai, smelling like flowers, like genuinely. The thingy hotel, what you may call it, let's wake up, Sina. The um. What hotel was it? The Fairmont always smells like flowers. So look, we're both in green. Come forth. I'm wearing like a... Like this brass stand. 
I'm wearing like this little set, but I wore this on top, so it's not too much. So I was wearing a little florally dress. I've lost my mask, I need to get one from reception. <laughs> This is the lobby of our hotel. We have arrived in Dubai. Okay, I immediately like this hotel so much more than the other one that we were at. We're going this way. Just very... My shoes are so... They're squeaky, oh my god, they're awful. It's like someone's like farting every four seconds. Yeah, this hotel is so much prettier. Next one. Um, it reminds me of the hotel, the Marriott we stayed at in Singapore. So your squeaky shoes, you're never wearing these again. <laughs> wow. Okay, I actually love this hotel. <gasps> so pretty. Open and airy. We are on the 25th floor. Let's see what the view is like. It's a city view. So that's like the Sheikh Zayed Road. I think it wouldn't hurt them to clean the windows. That's nice. That little bit. <laughs> um, it's a nice room. It's a nice room though, I like it. So this is what I am wearing. We're going to Nikki Beach now. Sol is, oh wait, my lighting is a bit off. There we go. Sol's in like this leopard print set. She looks very beautiful. Hi, thank you. Um, the rest of the day is gonna be shot on my iPhone because you're not allowed cameras in Nikki Beach, so come along.
so i'm walking back to the room um i'm actually really disappointed my boring sisters got way too drunk at nikki beach and didn't even drink at dinner like i was the only one drinking and it's only 1 a.m and they've both passed out so i didn't even make it to take a group picture in our matching dresses which is a disappointment um but i'm a bit bored let me see let me go into my room and see what siblings are saying so this is my kind of brunchy outfit Sol and I are gonna go get some breakfast sign is still sleeping um, we're gonna get some breakfast down at the mall so we're staying at the Fairmont Dubai I already showed you guys the room didn't I it's really really nice I like the view let me show you again I think I showed you last time but you've got that little dome thing um, and then you can see the Burj Khalifa at night um, I don't know if you guys can see it, but like it's like a really tall spike. Wait, let me see that one. That's Burj Khalifa, um, and it just twinkles at night time. So this is the Sheikh Zayed Road. Um, it's like the main road in Dubai, and in all honesty, in terms of location of getting to like restaurants and places if that's what you guys want to do when you come to dubai you want to go out to different restaurants and experiences like beach clubs like what we're doing then this is probably the best location to be i've never stayed at this hotel before but like i would 100 cents stay again the rooms are so nice and um, modern and clean and the hotel is really good the food was good last night we ordered some room service after we got back from nikki beach and the food was actually really nice um but if you want more of like a beach holiday where you're just kind of relaxing i would recommend staying closer to the palm or even on uh, the dubai marina is really good um because you can be facing the beach and also facing the marina if I don't know if you guys have seen my other Dubai vlog where I went by myself, I stayed at the La Meridian, that was really good. And let me think what other places I want to recommend. Oh, I've never stayed at JBR, but a lot of people say JBR, which stands for Jumeirah Beach Residences, um, is also really good. So maybe I'll check that out one day and let you guys know my reviews. But so far, from all the places that I've stayed at, um, I think in terms of location of getting to places, this one is the best. But obviously, it, this, if you stay here, you'll feel like you're more on a city break. Whereas if you were to stay on, let's say, Atlantis, the Palm, you'll feel like you're on a beach holiday. So pick what vibe you want. Also, where we're going to, back to Abu Dhabi um, tomorrow night, um, we actually want something that's a bit more city breakish now because our Abu Dhabi hotel is so beautiful you guys will see when we get there and it is a beach kind of holiday so we don't mind having city break vibes now anyway this is my outfit and it's all from motel and we're gonna go shopping well not really shopping just get a coffee if salt ever gets ready at this rate In literally 45 minutes, but we couldn't help ourselves. And also, we feel bad because Sina's sleeping. I'm not gonna lie, I don't feel so bad. I don't feel that bad, but look at this view. I actually did a vlog the last time I came to Dubai. No one actually knew because I didn't do a social media thing. Sometimes it's nice not to do everything on social media, but I actually do enjoy vlogging, so this time has to be done. We ordered a mac and cheese balls and a hot wings. We said we're gonna limit ourselves to one dish each. At first, it was just one dish between the two of us. Then Sol said, no, one dish each. So now we're doing one dish each so that we can still eat when we go <laughs> to the cove. <laughs> Yum, so this is our tiny premium. <laughs> I'm so sorry, I can't even wait. I've got to dig in. Oh, we've got buffalo wings, mac and cheese balls. <laughs> oh my god. Divine. <laughs> Oh, 
bar. So bring your vibe over here, here, here. And throw it up in We've the come air. straight from Namos to Dubai Mall, and I just want to give myself a 10 out of 10 for wearing these heels. I changed my heels. Mine are so flat. I'm so impressed. I've been wearing these and my feet don't hurt, surprisingly. I think probably because I've got such a platform that I'm actually walking on stilts and my feet aren't that arched. I feel like they hurt more when I just stand still though. But um, we've just been looking around the Fashion Avenue bit, which is so pretty. So nice. I'm going to um, kind of round off my Dubai vlog because um, I am currently in Abu Dhabi now. It's my literally first day here. I got here last night. Um, but to give you guys an overall review of how my trip was, it was really incredible. Um, the hotel we stayed at was aesthetically really beautiful, the Bermont Dubai. The rest of the holiday was really lovely. I loved like spending time with my sisters and doing all the fun like party stuff that I love to do. If you guys watch my vlogs, then you know I love a good little beach club party vibe. Um, but now we come to Abu Dhabi, and this is going to be a completely different vibe of a holiday. It's just so much more chill. This hotel is so beautiful. I'm just going to give you a little glimpse of the view. So this is our like balcony. 
Um, so I will catch you guys in my Abu Dhabi vlog. Uh, I hope that you enjoyed this and you enjoy my travel vlogs. If you do, then give it a thumbs up. Subscribe down below. And thank you again to Anna Louisa for sponsoring this video. Look how beautiful these earrings are. I'm absolutely obsessed with this brand. Thank you again for sponsoring this video. Don't forget to check them out. Their link is in the description. And I'll see you in my next vlog. I feel like I've been squinting in this whole outro. The sun is literally directly in my eyes. I'm sorry. Love you.